Hello everyone, this is Chris, Seven Seas Marine. Today we have a 2002 Bayliner Capri 215 Sport Bow Rider. It has a 5.7 250 horsepower inboard outboard motor. Uh, I'm going to start on the port side back and start coming my way around to show you the exterior here. Overall, it's a very clean boat. Um, you know, it's not brand new. It has some 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 marks. Here's a couple gouges right here. It's in the showroom actually at All Seasons Marina. Um, never been bottom painted. I can show you real fast to the bottom. That's a nice thing that it has never been bottom painted. Got trailer to tow. Life. Coming around to a cleat, and here is your. Capri Sport Emblem as well as your 215. Um, you can see the snaps because this does have a blue custom canvas. Let's come around the windshield area. We'll show you the inside in depth, but I just more or less want to show you the quality of the exterior. There's the front snaps for the front canvas coming into the bow. And let's see the Around the front, we got another cleat. We have your light. Here's your front area. Coming around the starboard side. Again, just minor. Small things typical of age. As you can see, it says APS3, it's, which stands for Advanced Planing System. It's that scalloped hull that you're seeing there for a quick plane. Boat's got plenty of power. It's 21 foot with, I believe, an eight point, an eight foot two inch beam. And there's your rear rear cleat, there's your fuel, swim ladder, swim deck. Let me go around the back side so I can show you a better shot of the back. Name of the boat is Watts on board. You can keep that or you can remove that obviously. Okay. And let's show you the I.O. Stern drive. There she is. That's the first segment, guys. Let's go to the ex uh, interior. Guys, this is Chris, Seven Seas Marine. We're going to do the second segment, the interior segment of the 2002 Bayliner Capri 215 Bow Rider. Um, this here is the sun deck. As you can see, it's nice cushioning, nice large area for bathing, which is attached to the back rear deck. Coming over top, you'll see the rear seating of the boat. And let me show you the, how the sun deck lifts up. And you have a nice shot of the 5.7 250 horse Mer Cruiser. Underneath this rear seating, you have storage under all three. Coming around the starboard side, we have grip handles, sto more longer storage. There's your driver's seat, it's in good shape. Throttle, uh, marine speaker for your JVC. CD player which comes with this boat as well as your mount for your Lowrance depth and fish finder which comes with this boat. Coming around into the cockpit you have your gauges as well as cup holders and your switches. This will be like your blower, your bilge, your accessory switches they are on both sides of the wheel. There you have your wheel and your rear view mirror to watch your uh, ski, uh, skiing. 
Coming across to the passenger side, here's your passenger seat, as well as some cooler functionality and some storage. There is your JVC and your Lowrance. Cup holder, another marine speaker coming around similar to the other side. The port side has the grab handles and the, the longer storage. Standing from here, I can show you the floors are carpeted up to the front. And there's a hatch for storage inside the floor, the center of the floor. Coming through to the bow, here's all your front seating and padding. It's all in nice shape. Here's your placard, which shows that it's nine, it will hold nine pounds, nine people, or 1,400 pounds with gear. These front cushions lift for more storage. And looking in this way, rear padding for your back. It's overall a really nice layout on this boat. Your center windshield obviously shuts, which is great. I have a boat similar to this and uh, the re reduction of uh, water and wind is just fabulous when this is shut. By the way, as you can see from here, that steering wheel does have tilt. And there are your trim tabs on your uh, throttle and your on off switch. Guys, that'll complete the second segment for this video. Thank you.